being justice of the peace, you see the same individuals coming time and time again into court. And that led to what I could say is a, a deep frustration, seeing the same young people over and over again. And each time I see them, I have to give them longer sentences because their crimes tend to get more sophisticated over time. What a lot of these young lads don't have when they're first coming in is hope. You know, now they've got a criminal record, you know, what chance have I got to get employment? What chance have I got to have anything? And I think one of the things that we find, again with the programme, is actually they start to realise that they do have the, the, themselves a way to better their lives, that, you know, change is possible. And, and therefore, you know, there's some hope. The more I got into the course, the more I realised how it was like my life was before then and how my life could change because I think when I went to like prison I sort of hit rock bottom at the time do you reckon and it was like everything was going wrong do you know what I, mean? I just didn't seem to care at the time do you know what I mean and I got onto the course and I thought like this can actually change your life and people can look the, look better at you and stuff like that and when I come out and did it when I finished my operation with no trouble and like now like all my friends are all back in I mean, like jail, because like, I've been like sticking to the course. Because it's not just about like presenting yourself effectively and all that. It helps you like with, like your health eating and stuff like that, showing you need to get your health eating and exercise and stuff like that. So instead of going out drinking all the time and partying and doing drugs, I mean, I was like spending my time like playing sport and going to the gym and stuff. So it's better like the course. The course does help. But I mean, and I want more people to see like me like it helps and it does it does you know what I mean uh, being proactive habit one um, gets people thinking begin with the end in mind really gets people thinking so I would say that begin with the end in mind is the habit that gets people to start to realize okay what is my end in mind what what is what, what is it that I'm aiming for in life? The habits that I quite, quite like to see is the win-win exercise and also talking about the emotional bank account. They really resonate with that, you know, and obviously that sort of thing. Oh, yeah, I've been running one of those for a long time. I'm not actually realising it. So, um, and I think the way that the habits build, getting the private victory, once they've got that, then they're ready for the, the public victory. We have something that would apply anywhere in the world and for many different types of client groups. So far we've been approached by um, Canada, South Africa, Australia, Holland, United Arab Emirates, Oman. We've used it to, um, to some extent in schools with young people and we've even looked at, we've even been approached by our primary care health services for individuals with minor health issues, mental health issues. So the flexibility with the program, because it's about getting people to take that personal ownership, personal leadership, and personal effectiveness, it applies to anyone that wants to own and drive changing their life.